Bah, the fog is thickening, and I have lost the river. Stay prepared, Joseph. We may find trouble ahead. So welcome to the level that Insomniac loved to show off when showing off Resistance 3. Poor Freddy Valmor. It'll never be as interesting as uh, Henry Stowell. Anyways, this is pretty much the level. As you saw me walking around on the boat, uh, we can't really go anywhere. We can't even jump onto that table there. We have a box full of infinite ammunition. So there's that. And there's a little box behind the cabin of the boat that has Look infinite health. Straight ahead. A kraken. The Kraken was one of the set piece Must bosses in Resistance 2. It, like the all of them, wasn't a really good set piece boss in Resistance 2. I mean, the set pieces in Resistance 2 looked cool, but the bosses. Having to fight them more than once just wasn't worth it. Why did you do that, Joseph? They are jumping onto the boat. <laughs> uh, if you don't disturb the leapers, they won't jump onto the boat. But uh, whatever. Those leapers are any indication. We may not be as safe on these waters as I had hoped. Here, take this. Classic Rossmore shotgun. It has not been fired for some time. Test it on those blast routes over there. So the second function of the marksman, which you'll see me using quite a bit in this level, since it's basically just defend that shotgun is effective in close quarters is it drops a little turret secondary fire with longer range concussion grenades try it concussion grenades don't really do any ammo at this point until you upgrade the shotgun Very good. if you need more ammunition you should find it in the container on the main deck thanks tips there we go it's one of the turrets right there oh no hey goliath approaching from the southwest to get through this level on Superhuman, you basically want to make sure you have turrets present on the ship at all times. They will draw fire, they will kill enemies, and you'll need that while you desperately try to survive. There's not a lot of places to take cover. How the ice is collecting on the Chimera and power conduits. The passage looks a bit narrow, but I think I can squeeze through. Hold on. Wait for it. <laughs> Damn, we are stuck on the ice. Where to go, Malakov? I will try to push through. Perhaps the shotgun could help break up the ice. Excellent. We are free. I will say this. This level has a lot of atmosphere. Probably the most atmospheric level in the whole game. 
You're just... You're just stuck on a boat the whole time. I mean, it's not terrible. Ah, the water is shallow. But we must keep moving. Just kind of, it is what it is. Joseph, did you hear that? Yes, I did. Hello? Is anyone there? It's not human. Don't call out to it. You fool. So Grimms are humans that get infected with the Chimeran virus that don't get picked up by crawlers, which are now extinct at this point. They've been phased out. Or spinners. So they don't have heat stacks on them. Uh, they haven't been, I don't know what, what raised by the Chimeran army proper. Uh, so they become feral. They are basically fast zombies, uh, for all intents and purposes. Fun fact that uh, you don't really see in earlier resistances, but becomes quite apparent here, and they make a, a bit of a stink about it. Um, the regular Chimera and the Feral Chimera, totally distinct. They do not get along. They are not friends. They will kill each other. The Chimera will fight Feral Chimera. The Feral Chimera will fight everyone. That said, just, uh, just infecting a human population and letting them turn into mindless zombies is great biological warfare even if the Chimeran army has no real use for these human bodies. Thanks, Tips. This street leads to the docks. Open water should be ahead. Old Grimm's on the roof of the diner. Section makes for a fun little shooting gallery. Oh, and I believe I now have the scope for the marksman, so that's nice. Yeah, there we go. The gun's effectiveness just jumped through the roof. Thanks for the sterling advice, Malakov. I certainly wanted them to be on the boat. We have found more open waters. You did very well, Joseph.
Shock drones. It appears they are attacking a group of leapers. Those leapers must be feral. Evolved independently, free of the hive mind. Very curious. This phenomenon requires further study. Hey, you heard it from the man himself. Very curious phenomenon. Anyways, as you may have guessed, the shock drones are Chimera army proper. So, yeah. Where they are, Chimera army won't be far behind. They have seen us. We're not exactly hiding. Ah, they have shorted the engine. Yeah, Malakov will start swearing in Russian, which is pretty great. Uh, post your favorite little things in games. Maybe Angry Capelli would work more if he wasn't a silent protagonist when you were actually playing him. Like, if when people spoke to Capelli in-game, there were some sound clips that played at certain times in response. Um, it appears we have found the river. I don't know. According to my map, we are now on the Mississippi. The city of St. Louis should be close. We will stop there and look for supplies. Chimera and army. It is coming this way. Terrible. We have no choice. We must stay here and pray. It does not take notice. Someone who speaks Russian can translate all of uh, Malakov's curses for us. That would be great. I want to know. I need to know. <laughs> looking right at us. It's seen us. We must outrun the Goliath. Hold on. And our boat has taken battle damage. Sweet. Now's the point where the drones really start to become useful. Also, the scope on the marksman is a huge help at taking out long legs. Behind us. 
Yeah, the marksman's way better at taking out ice than the shotgun. We are losing the Goliath! Just in time! This bolt is falling apart! Long legs straight ahead! The health and ammo do have a bit of a cooldown, so you gotta be careful. You can't just keep spamming the health, you gotta wait for the box to close again before you can reopen it. I believe it was Malakoff's bright idea to go along the river in the first place. Just want to point that out. Thanks, Malakoff. Another Goliath. We're so doomed. And that's it. That's the end of Resistance 3. Thanks for watching. I was Blind Sally. Um, I'll see you next LP. Beautiful.